Speaker, the Honourable Mr Tripodi, I'd like to address my speech today uh, to the Honourable Senator Evans, the Minister for Immigration. The other day my mum was cooking risotto. She was adding all sorts of herbs and spices and it was clear that it was a very complicated recipe. Add a little bit of this, add a little bit of that, I was baffled. I really had no idea what she was doing, I was so confused. But the funny thing is, is that a few days later, when my friend Dave was making some risotto, I felt qualified to give Dave some advice. I said, Dave, this needs more paprika. I don't even know what paprika is. <laughs> Yet I felt like I had the knowledge to advise Dave. And it made me think, it made me think how a lot of what we say, we, we say without knowing the facts. I think a perfect example of an issue that is talked about but not truly known about is that of refugees. A Herald Sun poll in March concluded that 92% of our population think that our borders are out of control. A refugee is somebody who is fleeing persecution, fleeing tyranny. These aren't people seeking a lifestyle change, these are people seeking a life. Last year Australia accepted 2,200 refugees. France accepted 35,000 and Canada accepted 55,000. What is it that we're afraid of? Are we afraid of a flood of refugees? Because no threat of mandatory detention will ever, ever prevent refugees arriving if the alternative is subjugation or worse. By promoting an anti-refugee policy, we won't be able to stop the boats because the decision is usually Australia or death. So ask yourself, what is it that concerns you about refugees? Is that concern warranted? When Davo's risotto tasted too much like paprika, I said, Dave, I do not know what I was talking about. I'm sorry about that. I think the worst thing about refugees is the way we look at it. It's time to wise up and adopt a more humane mindset. Yeah.